what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel welcome back welcome back and thank you for clicking on the video and greetings to all of you in the name of the lord jesus christ again greetings 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 and thank you for tuning in let's get right into it okay we had a possible school shooting uh stopped intercepted by uh the authorities what is going on you all wickedness is definitely abounding in the earth increasingly increasingly growing i know that there's nothing new under the sun but man is it just the fact that we have social media that we can see all of these things and all these different news outlets i mean what's really going on you all people just are increasingly gr growing more wicked more and more wicked this is just the perfect time for anybody you can do it at this moment at this moment um give your life to christ because this world is on a fast track okay a fast track a, a path that's heading straight to hell so everybody out there um if you haven't already uh, make sure you like the video wherever you are leave a comment please and uh just so we can keep this going keep the conversation going and make sure that everybody is staying engaged all right but let's get right into it let's get right into it um let me scroll up a little bit so you can see the headline here trans suspect arrested for allegedly planning shootings at colorado schools and churches there is a photo uh 19 year old um trans um suspect arrested william whitworth uh let's read some of this article you all what is going on with the shootings we just have no regard for human life god is a cre is the creator of life right and these people uh out there with these weapons man just no regard for human life william whitworth whitworth a 19 year old former student who identifies <clears throat> as a woman named lily is face, facing attempted murder charges after he allegedly planned to shoot up multiple schools and churches in Colorado. This news outlet, uh, Christian Post, refuses to acknowledge William as uh, a woman, as a female. They say he throughout the entire article. Who will you agree with? Will you agree with, with the world or will you agree with god hmm? uh let's keep going here whitworth's preliminary hearing is scheduled for may 5th his bond is set at seventy five thousand. take that up a few hundred thousand according to a thursday statement from the 18th judicial district's attorney's office i'm like out of breath the suspect is charged with criminal con uh criminal attempt to commit murder in the first degree criminal mischief menacing and interference with staff, faculty, or students of educational institutions. As has been reported, the suspect reportedly planned to shoot up the Timberwolf Middle School, Perry Hills Elementary, and Pine Creek High School. Upon arriving this on the scene on March 31st, deputies with the Albert County Sheriff's Office discovered the door to the suspect's bedroom was off its hinges. Copy of the affidavit obtained by 13 investigators noted that uh, the appearance of this Mr. Whitworth appeared drowsy and made suicidal statements. Uh, the report refers to the suspect with the pronouns she, her, which they refuse to use in this article. Um, they asked, you know, why did you want to do this? And the response was, why does anyone do it? Again, no regard for any of these people. No regard for human life. Um, when pressed about why he chose to target that particular school, the suspect answered no particular reason. Okay. Regarding how far the suspect's plans had gone, he admitted that he was about a third of the way from doing it. In addition to schools, he planned to target several churches he also referenced a page in his manifesto about mass killers when asked how he knew so much about school shootings. 
Authorities found a dry erase board with floor plans. I, floor, floor plans. Wow. Identifying the different levels of a school and two notebooks that also contain floor plans. One well, notebook contained a drawing of a clock as a uh, detonation device. After obtaining, uh, obtaining a search warrant, deputies discovered a copy of the Communist Manifesto and a book listing how the suspect wished to die, including freezing or drowning. Uh, what else here do you all want to hear? Okay. SCP reported last week, 20-year-old, 28-year-old trans uh, identified shooter Audrey Hill had a detailed map of the school and had been planning the attack for at least a month. The shooter was armed with two rifles and a handgun during the incident. Okay, you all. <clears throat> That's just some of the article there. Uh, take some time. Go check out the news. You know what I'm saying? Go check out these stories and see what's going on around the country and around the world. I'm very happy that they were able to stop this suspect um, before anything happened. Again, in America, <clears throat> excuse me, it's a bit different. We are innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. Obviously, they have a lot of evidence there. A lot of things that could be used against this suspect, uh, William. And I believe that uh, this was a very good thing here. Now, there's something going on in this country where all these shootings are taking place. The enemy is very busy. The devil is very busy. And he is getting into the minds and hearts of these people and corrupting them and giving them uh, 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 the idea to go out and kill people. Complete disregard for human life. Right. And, you know, this is not the first time this has happened. And. You know, we all wish that this would be the last time, but unfortunately, we are living in a time now where access to weapons is just, you know, it's, it's easy to get a gun, easy to get a weapon, or you're in close proximity to someone who has weapons, so you have access to those. And I just pray for the safety of these schools, these ch innocent children, these innocent workers, and these churches that are under attack as well. Members, uh, pastors, ministers who are there to worship God and there to learn about God. And they are trying to stay on a straight path and are killed by someone who has um, allowed their life to be overtaken with wickedness, with sin, with, with evil deeds. Okay, these people, if you understand, uh, if you read your Bible, um, people who do these kind of things, they are under the control of, of of the enemy, under the control of the devil. And I truly believe that. OK, this is spiritual warfare, you all. OK, we see fleshly bodies. We see people going out committing these murders and things. But there's truly a evil, demonic spirit leading and guiding these people to do these things and I know that we all have a choice I know that we all have choices in life but if you read your Bible you see that we are facing spiritual uh, 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 demonic forces that's what we are up against we see the body we see flesh we see uh, um, people doing these acts but behind the scenes right there's a spiritual battle going on if God can lead a man uh, to give his life to Jesus Christ, to turn his life around and start professing the gospel and start spreading the good news, then these demonic forces, the devil can also try and grab up a man, a woman, a child and, and lead them into doing wicked and evil things. Right. Uh, the enemy comes but to steal, to kill and destroy but God has come. Jesus has come to give us life and that more abundantly. We got to understand these things that we're not just facing off against fleshly bodies. Right. It's a spiritual warfare. So. Like I said, this is a great interception. Um, maybe some more things that come out here, but 
however they got to this person, to this individual, I am so happy that this thing was avoided, that people's lives were spared, and that we did not have another school shooting. Again, that other shooting that uh, took place, if we go back in the article, I believe that uh, it said that 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 person was planning for at least a month a month to set up uh uh the shooting so this person was stopped praise god praise god we are so thankful so grateful um for this arrest and let's hope that um justice is served we know that we're innocent it's a proven guilty but this is a lot of evidence and hopefully this individual, this individual can get help. Um, and you never know. Let's say some prayers uh, for Mr. William. And, and, and maybe, maybe he may give his life to Christ. That would be the ultimate, ultimate um, thing that could happen here. Man, turn his life around, surrender himself to God and, 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 and become a force for the kingdom of God. That's what I pray for. That he will give up that wicked life. Turn things around. Uh, be baptized. Repent. Be baptized. In the name of Jesus Christ. And give his life to God. And be filled with the Holy Ghost. Right? That's my prayer. Um. So thank you all for tuning in. Alright, this is the end of the video. Yep. Uh, thank you to those police officers who were able to stop this person from shooting up schools and churches in colorado thank you for all your hard work police officers keep doing what you're doing we're praying for you as well again all the social media outlets that i have listed up um in the banner check me out wherever you like to hang out all right and i'll see you in the next video peace